Hey friends, welcome to another Day in the Life episode. This time I'm on a GP placement in Dunstable. Let's go! The day started with the usual morning drills of hydration, sanitation, and a few push ups. I then rolled into a short time of Bible reading and prayer. Afterwards, I headed over for the free breakfast, which was provided for our accommodation, which is always very exciting every morning. Usually, it's just me at breakfast, so I listen to a podcast whilst eating. Can't believe it's snowing again, guys. Can you see just about? Um, it's supposed to be mid March, but it's still a bit wintry. <laughs> hey, guys, what's going on?、Um, just finished a morning clinic. It was pretty good. I got to one of my sign offs,、uh, did a peak flow assessment on some kid who came in with an exacerbation of asthma.、Um, and yeah, a few, other, a few other kids actually came in today. And anyway, Just enjoying、um, the great British weather. It was snowing this morning, now we've got blue skies. I think it might be raining or snowing again later in, in the day.、Um, now I'm just heading over to Aldi to grab some lunch. GP lunch breaks are notoriously long, so I took the opportunity to visit this priory nearby, which was founded all the way back in 1132. It also had some nice gardens around it to walk through. When I came back to the GP surgery, it was still closed for lunch, so we sat in the car and did some work. This is me in the staff room checking what patients there were for the afternoon clinic. On the way back, I wanted to practice my reverse parking, so I got some coaching from Benice. Like, so the go for that, you know,、there. the first solid line one. Yeah, because、like, the lines back there are visible, so go for that one. Okay, so that means I need to line up here. Then. Pull this way.、Mm-hmm. Okay, what is this? <laughs> okay, well, that, sp- that wasn't very good because the lines weren't visible, so you couldn't line it up properly. Okay. You might be wondering what I've just been doing.、Um, I've just been doing some cyclic hyperventilation. Basically, it's a practice I've started to incorporate to try to stimulate my immune system. There is some evidence, you know. That if you do this type of breathing, or sometimes it's called like Wim Hof breathing, and if you're exposed to like a pathogen,、um, you're more able to fight it off because of the release of like adrenaline from your adrenal glands, which can prime your immune system.、Uh, it does look a bit pseudoscience、uh, on the surface, but so far it's really been helping me.、Um, I haven't got any major infections this year at all, like this academic year, except for when I was in India, when I was not doing this.、Um, so. Yeah, I recommend you give it a try. I then got on with some admin work before going out on a run. I always like to explore new places on runs, and I was quite excited to find a hill near our accommodation. Hi guys, made it to the top of the hill. Pretty out of breath because I'm not used to the hills in Cambridge. And yeah, we got a great view of Dunstable behind me. I came here once when it was nice and sunny, and also when it was really windy. So this is a great spot just to experience all the. Weather conditions. Anyway, I should probably head back. But before we do that, we need the obligatory running scream. So get it? One, two, three. Come on! Afterwards, I came back to the room, then went for dinner. We were eating at this nearby pub on most days. And usually after dinner, we did some OSCE practice together, but today we were all quite tired. So I talked to my dad, then made a cup of chamomile tea, and did some studying. I worked until my laptop told me it was time to stop, and then I headed to bed. So that's all for this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, and bye for now.